Oh, you have to go to Sigma stage multiple times? Yeah. Because that wasn't his real castle, it was a trap. <laughs> and I have to go to his real castle and do a boss rush. Basically. Hey, didn't you, ooh. <laughs> yeah, didn't you already fight one boss though? Yeah. You're gonna have to do that eight more times. Well, I'm gonna have to fight all the bosses again, yeah. Okay. It's Mega Man, it's classic. You gotta do a boss rush. Usually, though, in the Mega Man games, didn't they show you, like, the different levels of his castle? Like, well, Wily's castle, I guess. Yeah, so. not Sigma. Okay. This is Chill Penguin. He's just gonna get fucked. Dunk on him. <laughs> I like that when Chill Penguin is in the room, uh, <laughs> like, a little hook comes down from the ceiling, like, oh, it's that guy. Just, he needs uh, that. He needs it, yeah. It's the only way he knows how to fight. It's just... It's actually more like a lucky stone sort of situation where he feels uncomfortable in a room that doesn't have a hook. <laughs> Maybe he's just a frequent party goer. Maybe he's just, uh, he likes hanging and swinging from the ceiling, like chandelier style. Oh, I was gonna go with a uh, wrecking ball. <laughs> he just is, uh, his day job is on a construction crew. <laughs> So, the original Mega Man bosses, the idea behind them, as far as I'm aware, was that each of them represented a certain industry. Really? Yeah. Like, Cut Man was for uh, lumberjacking and, like, if you're lumberjacking, uh, tree cutting. Uh, Tr what? Lumberjacking is a better word than tree yeah, cutting. Yeah, lumberjacking. Um, That's actually... What? What's wrong with lumberjacking? Elect elect Man was electricity... Uh, Bomb Man, I guess, was mining. Uh, but, and I guess there's like Flash Man and Crash Man and things. But, maybe they aren't supposed to represent industries. I know that was part of the story of why uh, why the robots were created in the first place. Oh, really? But anyway, but, so. I guess the animals are just like, they ran out of ideas, and <laughs> they were like, no. shit, fuck it, whatever. Actually, did you know that um, every Mega Man after, all the bosses after some generation of Mega Man were all fan-created? Were these all fan-created, yes, too? Yes, every single one of them. And they just... Deemed them all together as animals, I'm pretty sure. Oh, do you think that they, like, it was just a coincidence that they were like, oh, animals, or do you think that they, like, specifically... I think they specifically animals? chose animals. Okay. Like, they got tons of fan art, I'm pretty sure. And they just like that's really out. cool though yeah. that they that they chose that for each because I know that I had heard like Mega Man six or something had the first American designed uh, robot master but oh, yeah. I didn't know that they continued to do it oh yeah no all of them were huh pretty sure don't quote me on that because I might be wrong many, but I'm pretty sure yeah it's just like don't quote me on the industry thing I think it started that way but I I'm not absolutely certain fuck all of you. <laughs> Just camp in the edge like an asshole. We should just play Smash instead of this. Yeah. <laughs> well, we do have weekend episodes to get We together. do. We can do more Smash. Everyone's <laughs> gonna get really tired of Smash. <laughs> Who am I kidding? No one's gonna get tired of Smash. <laughs> just like you never get tired of Smash. <laughs> oh no! It's a, it's a baboon with the funky baboon nose. Like, <laughs> opens his eyes just a little bit to, like, peek and see where you are. Like, it's scared. Okay, good, good. <laughs> oh. Well, your eyes just fucking gone, dude. So he's just lost an eye that quick? Yeah. Oh, I'm about to die. <laughs> Speaking of losing things. So they're, the eyes are like really hard to kill until they come out of the socket and then they just explode on contact, basically. I guess so. I don't know. <laughs> I didn't even know Sting Chameleon was his weakness. I just picked one arbitrarily because it seems like the best way to get the angle on an eye. Yeah. But he cool. really got hit by that real fast. Sorry, sometimes I devolve yeah. into like weird dialect. He got real et by that real fast. <laughs> he just got et up, boy. Et him up. Et him on, So that wasn't the real castle either? No. You gotta do tons of little bosses, dude. 
It says ready at the beginning. It's like ready, and I'm like, well, I was ready. What if two I say levels no? Ago. <laughs> That's sort of like at the store when you like scan your uh, your card to pay for your groceries. It's like, is this amount okay? Like, what if I just fucking say like? No, I won't no. have. No, like, it's just the wording is really strange. Why not say, is this amount correct? And they're like, is this okay? And I'm like, no, I want it for less. I want my value. Y'all advertise about how y'all have low prices and stuff, but then I'm looking at this having to accept high prices. Yeah, I mean, that's just... Customer service. Man, highway robbery. It's like a survey where you have loaded questions. Is this amount okay? Because if it's not, then you can't have your groceries. Yeah, that's exactly yeah, that's what That's what they're is. fucking doing. And then they, like, put that forward to, like, their, uh... Their shareholders. They're like, see, everybody's okay with our prices. They said so. Says so right there. Okay, at first I thought this was a joke, but do you think that's actually what they do? <laughs> yeah, I wonder. <laughs> Fuck you, bats! I'm sure that there was some marketing person somewhere that specifically designed that question to be the way it is. Apparently a shit ton goes into marketing everywhere. Are you trying to figure out where the edge is? Like, oh, there we go. Really good. <laughs> I was trying to do that. <laughs> okay, Sting Chameleon. I got him this time. Now I got his weakness. You know something that I found really strange just going off the question thing that they What's asked that? you? Is... For some reason, it never occurred to me as a child that every single thing that is produced was designed by somewhere, someone somewhere along the way. Like, they didn't just pop into existence, you know? Yeah. Like, every single little detail was put in place by someone. For some reason, I never really thought of, like, the... Like, the gravity of that. Like... Even so far as, like, art and... Wait, you know, really? Like, like, well, yeah, art. I, I mean, like, paintings, yeah. But, I mean, like, movies and everything. Mm -hmm. Like, every single detail was had had to be put in place by someone somewhere along the way. I don't know. Fuck you! <laughs> you just laugh Get out of there! You're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, like, pick him up with your boomer quanger and carry him to you, and you just, you like, hold him, him by his collar. <laughs> yeah. Just like... Stop it. <laughs> it ain't funny. Stop. Up oh, here it comes again. And... I gotta get you this. Oh! Oh, he juked you hard. MLG Pro, dude. That time he was prepared. Mm. When do you think he gets this super armor? Is it just... Like, by magic, sometimes he just gets it. He just decides to go through your... Uh, your ice. It's not that he gets super armor. It's that um, my attacks don't work for a short amount of time after I just hit him. So if I uh, shoot him again too soon, he goes through it. That's what it is. Okay. Oh, fuck. Oh, octopus guy. Well, I guess if you fought <laughs> the octopus guy on land, it would be weird. Wait, when you blow him up, like, their face is just still there? Well, yeah, like the little tattered shreds of their faces. Ew. <laughs> Can you get out of me? Can you get me out of your mouth, please? <laughs> That's gross. I don't know where your mouth's been. Okay, what is this guy's weakness? Um... It's Armored Armadillo, isn't it? Which doesn't make any sense, but who gives a shit? I don't know if it's that or the electric ball thing. It's not electric oh. ball. We tried that one. It's okay. He's gonna get fucked on. Don't fucking tell me you're... Oh, yeah, it is Armored Armadillo. Oh, Spam that attack. It's not a weird head. Like a weird long head. It sort of looks like his head could like... Like there's that split between his eyes and the rest of his head. Looks like like Alien from Alien vs. Predator could pop out of there. Like the... What are they called? Uh, Wait, did Xenomorphs? you say Aliens from Alien? Like, like the uh... Aliens from Aliens vs. Predators? Or Alien vs. Predator? How about Alien from the movie Alien? Cause that's but what his name is an alien. His name is Xenomorph. Yeah, but he was. Oh. He wants to be referred to by his doctorate name. Okay. Why don't you call him Ridley Scott's aliens? That would have gotten that. Ridley Scott. What? No, Ridley Scott. Yeah. Is his name. Yes. 
It's like, I'm sorry, I gotta put something on my resume, you know, Xenomorph is like my band name. And uh, I t I'm trying to be professional now, so. It's oh, just gosh. so shitty. Yeah, like, run through this slightly shittier version of the level that you've already done. Okay, fireman. You ready to get Fine. blown away? <laughs> <laughs> Crazy circus. Elephants are in the circus. They balance on top of each other and hold each other's tails. And balance on balls and shit, I don't know. The only thing I, the only reference I have to the circus is uh, Dumbo. And Mike's or, headless chicken or whatever the Yeah, fuck. Mike's <laughs> Mike the headless chicken. Yeah. Well, now we got a headless uh, elephant to deal with, or a burnt, charred elephant. 